Hey guys, um, I got something, uh, I actually got it uh, yesterday, been wanting for uh, quite some time, just for whatever reason or another, uh, I just hadn't uh, been able to. Anyway, uh, my first echo chainsaws, you see these two down here, was the uh, CS400, which by the way, I uh, put in a lot of work today, very good chainsaw, and the CS400 I was really impressed by. Uh, uh, true underdog there. Uh, it, it's been fantastic. Shortly after that I wanted to uh, get the smaller so I do tend to uh, use the uh, 14 inch blades more often and I got the uh, CS310 which I've done a video comparing it to the uh, um, still MS171 and I uh, did just as well. Hung in there uh, really well. If not, uh, beat it. Anyway, that's uh, yeah, I'm gonna talk for another day. Anyway, um, yeah, I got the Timberwolf CS590. I got it from a dealer nearby. You can get the CS590 from um, Home Depot, and you know you'd have to order. They they don't uh, typically uh, stock it or carry it. Uh, given the uh, opportunity. I uh, will always try to uh, get it from a dealer. I have no problem with uh, getting things from Home Depot, but I'm always going to support the dealer first. And so, it from there, picked it up. Not to mention, I also got it for $20 cheaper, also from the dealer. Anyway, uh, that is a 59cc engine. You know, it's a pretty powerful engine. Uh, probably the closest thing I have to compare it to would be uh, the Husqvarna uh, 460 but the 460 has a 24 inch bar this one is a, a 20 inch bar anyway like I said um, 59 cc engine and I'll show you a couple of things that came with here of course your uh, tip guard there I did try that on put that on but uh um, I can't put the sheath on if that that's on there. I, I'm not kind of decide if I want to put that. I did put it on the uh, 310, but I don't know. And of course, you know you've got your molly tool always. <clears throat> and then Echo Chainsaw Safety Manual and. Uh, specific for this one uh, manual for the 590. No oil. No. Oh well. I don't need any more anyway. Okay. Well, let's take a look at this. Of course, we got our natural um, fuel oil in it. Uh, just like all of them, it's 51 ratio. Uh, just like the others. Stop start switch choke and up here yeah once again I'm doing this one-handed okay. your uh, air filter your spark plug does have a compression button on it now let's just see if I can put it back on one-handed okay Of course, your bucking spike. Take the sheath off here. And 20 inch bar on that. Anyway, I have um, busy this week, so I have never started it. And of course, I did set up a log here so we can uh, see how it does. So, with that said, let me uh, try and get this thing started. Hopefully no issues there. And let's see how it does.
There we are. On, choke out, no primer. Yeah, it'd help if I pulled the choke all the way out, by the way. Anyway, it's more. That is the Echo CS. Well, here, CS 590. I do recommend this thing. I like it. Anyway, I will see you in the next video.